Hey everyone, this is Ray with the channel Love Water Healing and I'm here to do a reading for all of my Sagittariuses for the month of October. We're going to clear out the energy for you Sagittarius to see where you're at for the month of October. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, give me a thumbs up, and leave me a comment down below. Let's clear out the energy now for Sagittarius for the month of October. Okay, so all eyes are on you. I'm just getting this like giant eyeball like looking down. <laughs> uh, yin yang. Here we go. Sit quietly and close your eyes. Breathe slowly and deeply. In your mind's eye, imagine a yin yang symbol representing two opposing but complementary forces, something that's found throughout all of nature. Yin is often symbolized as water or earth and is considered the receptive feminine force. Yang is symbolized by fire or wind and is the creative masculine force. While opposites, they are not absolutes. Nothing can ex exist on our physical plane without its opposite and neither part is superior to the other. Allow this image to move you to your center where you feel at one and at peace with your whole being. You are everything. Okay, so we're balancing out. We're getting that yin-yang balance here um, in the month of October. It's interesting. Uh, got the big eyeball that was watching us. Uh, Sagittarius. So it might be time for you to allow yourself to see all sides of the story and recognize that um, you're going through a healing time and take things in moderation. You don't have to go full force 110 sometimes it's good to just take a deep breath meditate for a moment and see where you're at because that healing and moderation brings you to a really beautiful place where you're able to follow your divine guidance um, there's lots of new good news that's coming in for you it's communication there's a shift in the energy for the month of october um, I feel like it's going to be really intense, but you have a lot of goals that are set ahead for you. Um, and all of those goals are going to be fulfilled as long as you follow and bring yourself joy. Now, a lot, I think, is going to depend on making sure that you feel balanced and you feel like you're healing. Now, I, I know, I know, Sagittarius, we don't want, want to take the time, okay, all the time. We want to be able to like look at it from a perspective of like, hey, I had some really good news and I'm just going to push forward on this. No, 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 no. Take the time to reflect on the change and the shift that's happening. And then realize that if you have joy and you've examined both sides of the story and you are in balance about them, that you have lots of success that's coming in for you in the month of October. It's very successful for you, but you need to take care of yourself too, Sagittarius. This is going to be super important, super important. Make sure you check your sun, moon, and rising to get a full picture of what this month has in store for you. Yeah, I just, Sagittarius, all eyes are on you, or just one big eye, I don't know. The cosmos, <laughs> the cosmos is reminding you how vast and how amazing the energy is out there in the universe. And it's time to start using your creativity. So maybe you haven't been as creative lately as you were before Sagittarius, but we know how creative you can be. And start creating the things that actually bring you joy because you have endless possibilities. Endless possibilities that are coming towards you this month in October. The goals, everything that you've set in place is coming. But you have to take some time to balance you and to heal you and to feel good about that balance. And, you know, I have permission to shine and be successful. So if that's what you're really pushing towards, having that success in your life, whatever it may be, you, I'm giving you the permission, Sagittarius. I'm giving it to you right now. Can you feel the energy? Take the permission for yourself. 
heal for yourself. It's important. That next step is coming. That everything that you set forth and everything that you have planned and everything that you've done could possibly be scrapped and that's okay. Because what comes beyond that is even more delicious. And I'm excited for you. I'm excited for the communication to open back up. I'm excited for this healing to finally happen for you. And I'm excited for you to start seeing the forest for the trees because you have permission to be successful in this life and to shine and realize that your creativity that you bring into this life and what you are and the vastness and the possibilities are endless, 100% endless. So merge with who you are bring together the dark and the light and put them back together it doesn't have to be separated any longer you can bring the balance back to yourself by healing yourself Sagittarius and healing who you are in your heart and start following your intuition because you've been doing stuff for other people and you haven't been doing for you and it's done it's done here in the uh, in this month of October it's all about you baby all about you so that's where you're at and I wish you the best of luck here in the month of October I'm sending you all the love I can Sagittarius it's going to be a beautiful one and that's all I have for you I really appreciate you being here make sure you hit that subscribe button down below as always love your water and love yourself and I'll see you on the next video I love you